What's the worst thing a teacher has ever said or done to you? Okay, the worst thing a teacher has done to me is I remember when I was in school, this was about the third grade, uh, we were making pumpkins for Halloween, and I couldn't figure out the instructions to make the pumpkin right, so the teacher tried to help me and I just couldn't get it right. And this was before I was diagnosed with autism or any other learning issues that I had. And, uh, this, so my teacher, um, was like, instead of trying to help me or show me step by step to do it, she just tried to get me to do it. She's like, how about we don't make it? And then I was like, she saw the sad look on my face, like, what's wrong? Because I really wanted, because I really wanted to get that pumpkin made. So she just ended up giving me one. But just instead to say to a student, oh, we're not going to do this activity because you, you're not able to do it, it's just messed up. Because, you know, I was excited to make it and it really just ticked me off. Another time a teacher was mean to me was in uh, high school. She said, if you ever, if you were meant to be a model or if you were meant to be successful, you would already been, they would already scoped you out. It's like, how do you say that to somebody in high school? You know, and this teacher, I don't know what her problem was with me. I tried to take her class, and I just could never successfully pass her class. She was like, well, they would have already scoped you out. How would they have already scoped me out? Because I haven't been around the world to be seen. So it just made no sense to me. And then, you know, I think that's all my other stories. Oh, and then I have a story from high school. They wouldn't let me take cosmetology school at the, the career center. And this is career centers like a vocational school. They wouldn't let me take it because I had an IEP. And they wondered why I dropped out. Because they wouldn't let me take cosmetology school. They said my IQ wasn't high enough. That I was good at wearing wigs, doing wigs, and doing makeup. And they saw this. But they still wouldn't let me take, my, take the course I wanted. Which was unfair. And then they wondered why I dropped out. Well, I dropped out because you guys wouldn't let me do what the fuck I wanted to do.